Hi, welcome back to the final review on the Mighty Max Battle Warrior series. The gargoyles are very big in mythology and pop culture. And these weird giant flying creatures fit very well for the Mighty Max franchise. So it was inevitable that Max was going to square off with one. <laughs> yeah, let's check out the gargoyle. Officially called Mighty Max Shatter's Gargoyle. Now this giant fella is a solid mix between those 90s gargoyle characters and a Tim Burton statue. <laughs> he has demon horse legs, quite a few spikes, a spiky beard, and he has a stone face. <laughs> yeah, he's a very stoic individual. Now to open, you pull his head right up and pull the body down. As for the characters, we got Max. Over here, he is armed with a spanner and a utility belt. And for the villain, we have Basilic. He is a green skinned gargoyle wizard with a purple cape. Now, he's using his powers to revive the stone gargoyle army to rule the world. Design wise, he has a combat stance, so it shows that he knows how to use a sword. And he has a pet minion called the Stone Dragon. Yeah, he's a bit of a bizarre mix between a dragon and a gargoyle. Oh, and he has a sharp beard. <laughs> also, he can be separated in half. Now, as for the giant gargoyle, his interior is pretty much a stone tower. At the bottom, we got a ladder with two little gargoyles on the sides. Stickers indicating more stones. Two skulls on the wall next to an ancient symbol. And then we have the roof, which can be removed. Now combat wise, the gargoyle is armed with giant bronze spears. Unfortunately, I don't have the original pieces, so I had to create these custom ones instead. Now with his wings, he can use them as a shield. So it shows he has a good balance of offense and defense. Now as for the official comic strip, it's pretty insane. So Max is in Europe, having a tour in Moyne Castle. Things seem to be going okay, but somewhere in the castle, Basilic is performing a ritual and revives the giant gargoyle from his crypt. The gargoyle and the stone dragon go nuts, causing terror in the castle, attacking the tourists. So Max has to get to work. Now Maxi gets the monster's attention and gets the gargoyle to throw his spear at him. But Max dodges it and the spear impales the stone dragon. Now eventually Max discovers an ancient chant which reverses the gargoyle curse. Max recites the chant, and it ends up obliterating the giant gargoyle. We see the stone gargoyle shatter into pieces, crashing onto Basilic. Once again, Max saves the day and does an epic speech. Now for closing. To my knowledge, you store the stone dragon in the back, like so. Shut the body. Place Basilic here, and Max here, and shut the head. Yeah. Well, I hope you enjoyed the reviews on the Battle Warrior series. They may have not had the impact like the Doom Zones, but they were still kind of creative, and they all kind of had an interesting visual. So next time, I'll be reviewing the big one. Oh yes, the very big one. Anyway, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next one.